when I was in Guatemala, one day, Irma, this lovely indigenous woman, came into the kitchen and she said, my hands were burned shut at the age of two because I fell into an open fire in my family's home. You see that, you make a difference. My husband was a physician, so after my husband died, I'd always wanted to go on a medical team, and I didn't think you could go unless you were a doctor or a nurse. So I offered to do whatever there was to do, which was to cook in the kitchen. When I was in Guatemala, one of the things we saw was that the most dangerous activity a woman in the developing world can undertake is cooking for her family. Most of these women spend all day cooking indoors over smoky open fires. And most of them have a baby on the front or a baby on the back. So that baby is inhaling so much smoke it's equivalent to three packs of cigarettes a day. I saw babies whose lungs were so choked with creosote, they couldn't intubate them. They couldn't put the tubes down their throats, and so they couldn't save the baby's lives. It makes me cry because I just think of how people live and how I live. I'd heard of fuel-efficient stoves. I knew that that was a way to get rid of those open fires in the homes. And so we started this initiative to establish factories to produce and sell stoves. And at that point, that was the beginning of Stove Team International. What we did was we developed the Ecosina, which is a portable stove. It saves 50% of the wood that's being cut. It saves 70% of the particulate matter and carbon emissions. And the exterior is cool to the touch even after you've been cooking for some time. To date, we have uh, started six factories in five countries. I want this to go on forever. That's why we're establishing factories rather than, than just distributing stoves. We could have just distributed stoves. But then I didn't stop with one factory. You know, I kept, I kept going. You know, I'm very lucky. I, I was left with enough money to do what I want. I don't know if this is what I want to do. <laughs>